So Caitlin Johnson tweeted out this. This is kind of an amazing. Sky News was trying to uh, gin up support in Australia <laughs> for a war in China. And Caitlin Johnson says, in its attempt to propagandize Australians into consenting to war with China, Sky News Australia accidentally does the look how close they put their country to our military bases meme. You want to see this? this is, so this is supposed to try to, this is supposed to make you angry at China and want us to go to war with them. But what it reveals is that we're the aggressive, maniac, murderous mother effers who are again, once again, uh, causing havoc. Here we go. Watch this. So th this is the United States plays a major strategic role <laughs> in the Indo-Pacific. With 375,000 personnel, there's a vast network of operations that extend from Hawaii all the way to India. I think I see it. So did you see that? I don't know where Sky News team went to propaganda school, but uh, the next time you hype up an enemy, try, try to make them look like the scary ones. Because that makes the United States, this makes the United States look scary. Watch. Come on. Play it again. The United States plays a major strategic role in the Indo-Pacific. With 375,000 personnel, there's a vast network of operations. Jesus H. Look at all our look at all our military bases around China. How many military bases does China have around the United States? Zero. And it better stay away from the Philippines, too. <laughs> Zero. How many uh, submarines does that represent? Or is that just like a <laughs> like when there's a sea monster on a map? <laughs> At least play the good guys music. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> right? What, you, 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 Don't you, play the <laughs> ominous music. You're yes. showing a map of our Death Star size war machine. <laughs> Maybe maybe play some better music that extend from hope. Look at that. Look at all the submarines. Boom. boom. These oh, are, you know, those are nuclear. They're right off the coast. Could you imagine if Russia had all that shit around? I mean, or China. I don't even like oh, it happening around their own water. Look at that. <clears throat> all the so, and this is all on the other side of Hawaii. <laughs> this is all from Hawaii over. We are maniacs. You think Rome got overextended? Oh my God! Again, in America, where people get they go bankrupt when they get sick and are living under every bridge, this is what we're doing with our money. <laughs> Just so you know. Uh, so she comes back. She says the U.S. is rapidly militarized, militarily encircling China with extreme aggression while propagandizing the world into consenting to war. If you believe the people running the United States are bought by China, it's because right-wing media have melted your brain. Yeah. That's that they're all oh, they they do try to say oh like Biden's in bed with China shit like that. That is <laughs> mental. Uh they're you're no. thinking of Canada. <laughs> you're, the, Joe Biden works for the machine, the war machine and the wa Wall Street machine. Yeah. And they want it. They want a war with China, Taiwan. I don't understand it. You're thinking of Nike in the NBA. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So here's a, uh, and you th look at this. So this, I love this. You thought Russia was the aggressor. These are all the United States military outposts. Holy F and F. Uh, accuse the other side of which you are guilty, says Joseph Goebbels. 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 <laughs> I don't think it's a fair comparison, though, since no one in our corporate media has the nuance or subtlety of a Goebbels. <laughs> By the way, you see this? I, this? Somebody tweeted this out. This is all the different headlines. How to choke Iraq. Bomb North Korea before it's too late. American bombs make Iraq stronger. Bomb Syria, even if it's illegal. <laughs> Bombing Iraq isn't enough. This is all from New York Times. To stop Ar Iran's bombs, bomb Iran. Oh my God, I'm so hard. <laughs> this is like a porno, a series of porno books for for like choke a, for, them, for bombing them. Yes, for John Bolton or or Dick or Dick Cheney or or Joe Biden. It turns out. Dick or, Cheney or just a Democrat. <laughs> apparently, wow. You know that old nickname, the hammer. Yeah. Right. For people who see every problem as a nail, America. I think their nickname should be the bomb because we see every problem as a country weaker than us. <laughs> That needs to be bombed. Wait, wait, look, go back to those names. These are even porn names. 
Ian Hard. Am I misreading that? Heard. R- Ian oh. Heard. Oh, that's it, Hard. Ronald <laughs> Steele, though. <laughs> oh, Ronald Steele. Sure. These are porn names. Yeah. What is that? I can't even make that out. Jerome. Jeremy Surf. <laughs> These are porno names. Those are. Uh, Bill Crystal. That's a porno name. Yeah. Uh, John R. Ball. That's Bolton. Yeah. There you go. And just Bolton. to remind people. This is all the mill. I'm playing this all over and over again today. This is all the military bases. If you just spin the globe, you'll see all the military bases of the United States. Now, what do you say it reminds you of? A uh, the pedophile registry. The uh, pedophile registry. No, like, or just sex offender. It's a, it's. Bunch- we ha- we have five military bases in Australia. The United States has five military bases in Australia. How many do we have in the Philippines? I don't know. Like at least three, probably six. Look at all of them in Central America. Look at all the military bases. Look at all the freaking military bases. <laughs> now you know where that trillion dollars a year is going, huh? Trillion. Well, the one on the books anyway. Yeah. Go to jimmydoor.com to see my new stand-up special, COVID Lies Are Funny. For only $10, you get to become a premium member, too. And come see us do our live shows. We're going to be doing stand-up comedy in Milwaukee, Nashville, Honolulu, Los Angeles, Northampton, Massachusetts, Syracuse, New York, Coho's, New York, Hartford, Connecticut, Baltimore, Maryland, and more. Go to jimmydoor.com for a link for all those tickets. Mm-hmm.